The world's increasingly volatile climate is now one of the core risks to manage. When it comes to long-term investment in agriculture, uh, we've put in a lot of time thinking about rainfall patterns, uh, climate change scenarios. Uh, Adrian Gooming, Agriculture Investment Director at Warakiri Asset Management, said at the Jaina Annual Conference uh, in Sydney on Thursday, the company has over a $3 billion uh, under management and has invested in broadacre crops, dairy and horticulture across Australia. Uh, extreme heat and heavy rains have damaged crops across the world this year, from corn and soybeans in the Americas to wheat in China. Parts of southern Australia have seen a decline in rainfall over recent decades, and the nation's climate has warmed by an average 1.47 C since records began in 1910. Rising global temperatures threaten to damage crops that rely on predictable weather, which will likely lead to higher food prices. That raises the risk of governments curbing exports to run to uh, those food security for their own citizens. Yeah, so kind of trying to alert folks out about Indians and Indian tell them If we can invest in businesses where we can minimize our exposure in a climate uh, which really impacts yield or productivity, and that's where we like to get involved uh, with Frank Barillero uh, from Rock Partners, uh, which has about $8 billion uh, under management, said uh, during an interview uh, at the conference. Uh, uh, Naveen Natural Capital Global Head Martin Davies said there was a lot more opportunity uh, to add value uh, with permanent crocs such as grapes, uh, and that technology is an important part of the asset selection process. Um, uh, it means kind of uh, using climate prediction models to look at particular locations uh, where there will be a heightened risk uh, in the future and opting not to invest in those particular areas, you said. That's not just in general terms, that's getting down to individual crop types. The National Capital has more than $12 billion of assets under management, including over 3 million acres across nearly 600 properties in 10 countries, according to its website.